Hello, and welcome back to Quill Pig Gaming's blind playthrough of Hogwarts Legacy. So, last time we got everything set up, we built our character, and we started playing for the first time. And we got all the way up to Hogwarts. So, now, let's see if we can get sorted into our house with our default character with his ancient name. Traditional, old school name. I still don't know what year this is supposed to be taking place. Okay, we're replaying the Pensieve. How did you... What is this place? I had to finish I downloading know. last night. But I found Get the rest of the game on here. Above that, basin. that is no mere basin. That is a pensive for viewing memories. I wonder... I like Professor Fig here. I really hope he doesn't turn out to be a bad guy. Follow my lead. They made all of this inside his vault in a bank. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do anything to obtain. Yes, and if we are correct, Charles, the ritual wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge and the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can. what you're seeing. The glow that surrounded them. Yes, sir. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed, but could never. Miriam, and perhaps George, died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And you, it seems, are the key to understanding why. We were... It all looks rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. Who were they? I don't know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in there. I was right. Ranrock. Seems my reputation precedes me. Uh, he's gonna, I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit. He's going to brutalize that other nice goblin again. And why again. are you here? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here and we can let bygones be bygones. <coughs> uh, sir, they had the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I... I only meant that the instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. I was to grant access only to one with the key, and you didn't have one. I have no patience for traitors. Anything. Hmm. Well, perhaps your young 
friend here will be more helpful. Playing on a Switch, I wonder if the graphics are a whole lot better on PlayStation 5 or on PC. I'm not a big graphics snob, so it doesn't really matter to me, but I do hope other people find this okay. Or at least not distracting. who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both, wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. Yes. I don't imagine a coal train like that could be much older than, like, 1880 or 1890. Maybe that's our date? Until they give us a more precise one. sorting ceremony. Ooh, do they still have the hat? Or do they have an, a different way? No. It's Godric Gryffindor's hat. So it should be the same way. Here we go. the sorting ceremony. I'm no expert, but that seems more appropriate. Now, I need to study this locket as soon as I can, but first I must contact the Ministry. They need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Of course, sir. Thank you. Ready for the sorting ceremony? <laughs> Portrait. Prepare yourself to meet the headmaster. Sears Black Ancestor. Fig, nice of you to join us. The sorting ceremony is over. There were complications. Complications? It seems the goblin Enough. problem was... Goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig, and I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. 
If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. Professor Weasley, we've one more to be sorted. Welcome. You're just in time. Have a seat. Seems to be a lot of female staff for 1800s. Maybe it's later than that. Ah, yes. A bit older than the others, aren't you? <laughs> you come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. I'm looking forward to meeting my professors and learning all I can at Hogwarts. Indeed. Hogwarts has much to offer a dedicated student. And what you learn in class will prepare you for challenges outside the classroom as well. Mm. Hmm. I wonder... Mm. I detect something in you. A certain sense of... Mm. What is it? Um... Curiosity? Daring? Mm, maybe a loyalty? Let's go with curiosity. Because why are we a fifth year? For the first year? It makes no sense. I want to know that. A desire to learn? I do enjoy a good puzzle, and I believe I have a ready mind. Mm. You're clever indeed. You have the ability to reflect clearly on that which puzzles others. And you've a ready mind. Quit to learn. Perhaps you belong in Ravenclaw. Well, that's good. Get our right house. Um, sorting hat will take your choice into account when sorting you into your house. Ravenclaw house, known for intelligence, creativity, and wit. Except house. You belong in Ravenclaw! And one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. Ooh. Does that mean there's no Quidditch in this game? Enough! It's not as though I've banned flying altogether. But don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Hmm. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Weird dismissal. Quite an entrance. It's lovely to oh, meet you. Professor Weasley. I'm Professor Weasley, would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. <laughs> as I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As Deputy Headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. She seems nice. And Weasley's a good name. It's quite uncommon for a student to begin as a fifth year. Might be a bit of a challenge, yes. but one I'm sure you're up for. I am, Professor. This is the entrance to the Ravenclaw common room. You must solve a riddle to enter. I won't be of much help, I'm afraid. This sort of thing has always confounded me. So is she a Gryffindor or a Hufflepuff? Who lived longer? The ghost or the poltergeist? 
a ghost or a poltergeist. Hmm. A non-being can never have been. Well done. Now, go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. Yeah, I like her. safety razor and a straight razor. I don't know why there'd be a straight razor at all. Also, where's the wash bowl? Hmm. If you're gonna shave, you need a bowl. Uh, scroll holder? Or, oh no, owl post. More shaving stuff. Tea. picture. Shudley Cannons. Age appropriate poster. Appleby Arrows. Okay, that's a team. Wait, what's the date? 1612. I love exploration. the direction they want us to go. That looks like a comfy chair. Bunk beds sound great to people who haven't had to be in bunk beds. That kind of suck for a whole year. Oh, I can move faster. There we go. What's that? Washroom? They have their own washroom. Bathtubs. Stuff on the floor. It seems kind of dirty. Okay, then that makes sense why they don't have a washing basin up in their room. Stalls. Urinals. And... Okay. This is somebody else's room then? Yep. And again, pretty identical. Nice big wardrobes though. Level 3 lock. Different levels of locks. Okay. Gotta remember. Bottom of the stairs, level 3 lock. Okay, that's our room. I suppose some introduction. <laughs> this should be interesting.
think that's you that talked. One moment. Watch these. Why? That wasn't quite the reaction I wanted. Oh well. Right. What did you hope would happen? I suppose I hoped it would lighten the mood. Ravenclaws can be a bit on edge the first day of class. I'm ever it, by the way. You seem downright calm next to some of these characters. And you survived a rather harrowing trip here. I'm looking forward to my first day, or I'm actually a tad nervous. I think I'm looking forward to my first day. I'm glad to be here. Ready for classes to start. Good. Glad to hear it. Truly, there's no reason to be nervous. Most professors are firm, but fair. I mean, not all of the tricks I play are as simple as a tossed dung bomb, but I'm still here. Wait, did you say most professors are firm, but fair? Ha, <laughs> I did. But probably best I let you judge for yourself. I do tend to push their limits. I should wander off before someone traces that dung bong back to me. Nice meeting you. You too, Everett. Okay. Introduce yourself to Amit and Samantha. Those seem to be required, so... Can I pick that up? Nope. Me either. I love this carpet. That is a gorgeous carpet. Rowena Ravenclaw, maybe? Seems like it would be. Can't talk to people who don't want to talk to me. Who are you? Nalio we Wildsmith? Hmm. And the clock. And you're not gonna let me go down until I finish these two. Starting That's either. Wait a second. Can I go upstairs first? What's upstairs? Why is there a section of paneling missing? Hmm. Mysteries. More Quidditch stuff. Study room? One lock, okay. Finding more locks. What is that? Trash, maybe? Year seven. Level two lock. Exploring around. All right. Deep breath. Amit? Why, hello. Would you like to take a look? It's daylight outside. Wouldn't you blind yourself? Can't see too much in the day. Well, except for stars like Sirius, Canopus, Vega, and Arcturus. I'm Amit. Pleasure to have you in Ravenclaw. Never met someone who's been so close to a dragon before. Can't say I'd recommend it, frankly. It's nice to meet you, Amit. 
I take it you like astronomy? Oh, yes. So much to be learned from the stars. Also, there's something about the open air and night sky above the tower. It's invigorating. Hmm. You will adore astronomy. Professor Shaw is incredibly knowledgeable. I've uh, never been one for stargazing. I'm afraid I'm not much for memorizing constellations. Enough to worry about on the ground. Well, you should know that all fifth years must take astronomy. However, I think you will feel differently after one night up on the tower. It's possible. A quality telescope can show you things you never dreamed of. I suppose I'll see you in class then. Yes. Oh, and speaking of class, better get to my first one of the year. Nothing like the smell of fresh parchment, is there? Be seeing you. <laughs> Actually, I agree. I, uh, I like stationary supplies. Post-it notes, pens, fountain pens, so many good paper. Do I get an owl? Mm, that's not right either. Huh. Okay, so you're the other person to talk to. Anything else around you before? Nope. Center. Nope, just you. Okay. That's not right either. Samantha Dale. Herbology. I want him to be in the perfect place. A place he'll be happy with. But I can't seem to find it. Great golden gobstones. I want him to thrive here. Golden gobstones? <laughs> My own little expression. I bought this Dittany seedling from home and I so want him to feel cozy. Mm. Dittany is amazing, isn't it? So much healing power in such a little plant. <laughs> I've a bit of a thing for plants, as you can see. <laughs> Pleased to meet you. I'm Samantha. Nice to meet you, Samantha. Is Dittany used in Wiganwell potion? It is! Looks like someone's been studying up on their potion making. Actually, Professor Fig told me about the Wiganwell potion. Of course! I heard you were studying with him before term. He's an enigma, Fig. Teaches about theory, yet seems to know a lot about practical magic. <laughs> Quite knowledgeable. Professor Fig does know a great deal about, um, different forms of magic. Well, I hope he told you about more than Wiganweld. You've lots to catch up on, I'm sure. Hmm. Do most students grow their own ingredients? Is it common practice for students to grow their own ingredients? Oh, yes. In fact, our herbology teacher, Professor Garlic, encourages it. And I don't think Professor Sharp, our potions master, cares where you get your ingredients, as long as your brews are all perfect. Garlic and Sharp. An affinity for herbology is more typical of a Hufflepuff than a raven claw, isn't it? Ordinarily, perhaps. But it runs in my family. We've a full plot of these little fellows back home. Hmm. I suppose you could say herbology is in my roots. <laughs> okay. That is a family joke. It was nice to meet you, Samantha. Good luck with your Dittany. Thank you. And good luck to you too on your first day. <laughs> hey there. New Ravenclaw. Professor Weasley is looking for you just outside. You would best not keep her waiting. Okay. I still want to know what to do with this. Can I? Nope. Can't. Maybe I need a fire spell. Oh, downstairs. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts? I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. <laughs> now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. 
They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Hmm. I wonder if I actually get to take the owls, because that'd be kind of cool. Here you are. Year one through four primer. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It okay. will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. You would be wise hmm. to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. Armpits of black hole. Thank you, Professor. But what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. Okay. Walk away. This way. The guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding law. Why is that uneven? That should be finished. I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Revelio on this bust and see what details the field guide can provide. Revelio. Collect field guide page. Raymond Claw bust. Guide pages. This bust created in in honor of Ravenclaw House resides in the lofty Ravenclaw Tower. You've just unlocked a field guide challenge. Your progress towards completing challenges appears here. Field guide challenges are the only way to acquire experience points or XP. Open field guide. Oh, okay. This is your wizarding level. XP earned from challenges increases your level and power. Level one. Your field guide tracks your current challenge progress. Select challenges from menu to continue. Challenges. Collecting your first guide page unlocked a new challenge category. New challenges you unlock throughout your adventure will appear here. Select field guide pages to continue. Collect two field guide pages in Hogwarts. Gear appearance reward Hogwarts regalia spectacles. Are they special stuff? Spectacles do anything for me? Each challenge has tiers. Special rewards unlock at each tier you complete from appearances to critical upgrades. Okay, so maybe it's just, just a skin. Rewards must be claimed from the challenges menu. Come back often to collect rewards you have earned. Okay. Hold on. Quests. Okay. Start your first day. Assignments. Main. Relationships. Side. Completed. All. Okay. Map. Ooh, that's cool. Got a 3D map. I have some staircase of Hogwarts. South wing. Library annex. Astronomy wing. Bell tower. Great hall. And we've got chests. Field guide pages. Oh, that's a lot of pages. Demigai statues. 
Astronomy tables. There's one. Okay. Hogsmeade world. Okay, so I can't change maps. That's fine. Was I already on quests? I was already on quests. Challenges is the one that they had me look at. Yep. Okay. Collections. Revelio pages. 150 Revelio pages. Okay. Enemies, tools, traits, wand handles. Ooh, I get different wands. Conjurations, ingredients. Not that many ingredients. Brooms, okay. Beasts. Okay, there's a lot of costumes. Conjuration's the heaviest, traits, okay. Inventory. Oh, beasts, quest items, notes, resources, okay. Gear. Okay, yep, a lot of gear. Okay, so I get like free gloves. Wand handles. Can't change that. Face wear. No magical properties. I'll probably sell those at some point if there's no reason to keep them. Headwear. Ooh, pub cap. Flat cap. Sure. Got a scarf. Natural beige scarf. Sure. Traditional school robe, well appointed. Oh, okay. Hood. No hood. Change appearance to invisible robes. Oh, okay, so I can put stuff on for for the bonuses it gives me and then not have it show on screen. Okay. Let's go back. Outfit. I don't like having the pop-ups. Why? Okay, that went away. I can have a flying mount or a broom with upgrades. Nice. Okay. I don't think I need settings. Owl post. Does that mean I get an owl? Talents. Okay. Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that inside and outside of the castle. Mm -hmm. This looks like a big game. Lots of collectibles. It actually, feels kind of like a uh, Lego Harry Potter. No time to waste. You've classes to attend. Like tons of stuff to pick up. Where are we going? Where are we going? Rebellion. I see stuff. Just. Okay. There's something there. There's a 
chest inside. Revelio. Ah, good timing. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use blue flames oh. to get around a bit quicker. Your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. Okay. Hogwarts divided into two main areas. Left side of the map is where students' and professors live. Includes the house common and room, house common rooms, and great hall. Wait, what is? So you can see the blue flames available in that region. Green represent flames you have discovered, including your own house common room. Gray reveals the location of undiscovered flames. Select the annex region to continue. follow this for as long as she needs us to, but I definitely want to walk around and see what's in between spots. Fast travel seems to really cut around some cool stuff that are in games sometimes. Central Hall. Okay. You can get almost anywhere in the car. Revelio. Central Hall. Oh. Okay. So I discovered those. Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive. Our King's Cross Station, so to speak. should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. Oh, fun. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Charms class. What will I learn in Charms class? Exactly what you might expect. Spells, charms, jinxes, all terribly useful. I think you will enjoy Professor Ronan. He's a clever and entertaining wizard and a talented teacher. Can you tell me more about the Defense Against the Dark Arts class? Defense Against the Dark Arts, as the name implies, focuses on how to defend oneself against the evils that lurk beyond these walls. A mastery of Defense Against the Dark Arts is required for those who aspire to become Auras. Fortunately, we are lucky to have the ever-gifted Professor Hecate in charge of our students' education hmm. in that regard. Hecate. You mentioned Hogsmeade, Professor. Hogsmeade is the only all-wizarding village in Britain and is home to an array of shops and pubs. You should be able to find all of the school supplies you require in Hogsmeade. You will also, I imagine, enjoy many a butterbeer there with friends in due course. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day, and you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside <laughs> of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. Mm. We did take a bit of a detour on the way here. Ended up exploring some ruins and... I shouldn't say more. I don't want to exploring lie to her. Exploring ruins? 
Well, I presume Professor Fig has his reasons for keeping the details to himself for now. Speak of the devil, <laughs> Professor Fig. Your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfectly good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the <laughs> dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very well. Enough chit-chat. I need to get to class myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. This is professional. Good luck today. And remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you. And invaluable to me as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. <laughs> Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. Yay, homework. Actually, before I talk to you, I saw something here. It must be difficult to let the work happen. Rebellion. What can I do with that? How do I... Oh. I don't know what you do. I'd like to retire to Hogsmeade one day. Open a pub. Whatever it is, that's cool. But they really put guardrails on what you can do. I hope that disappears over time. What's this? Nothing? Rebellious. Oh, something down there. And stuff over there. What are you? It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today, before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you and Professor Weasley talking about exploring ruins? I hope I didn't say too much. She caught me off guard. I didn't tell her anything else about our travels sir. I will say, I think she suspects we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. <laughs> it was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well-trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guide's map? Unfold it and have a look. Okay. Okay, the shield represents main quests. Completing main quests will further the story, unlock new features, and grant XP. Some quests are locked by spell and or level requirements. Okay, in these cases you will need the required level and or have the required spell to activate the quest. New spells can be earned by completing professor's assignments. 
Okay. Or as quest rewards. Track a quest with A to continue. Charms class. Defense against the Dark Lords. Okay, so... I get to pick which one? Field guide map shows Professor Hecate's classes in the lower section of the astronomy wing. I could get lost in this castle. I may need to use the charmed compass in the field guide to help me find a way. Okay, or charms. Leviosa, maybe? Actually, Accio seems more useful. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. Yes. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. Hmm. Okay, so I've got Charms class. Quest complete. Welcome to Hogwarts. Cast Charm Compass. All kinds of things just happen. Okay, so it's that way. Now, what is this? Ugh, what am I missing? Hello, I, I don't believe we've met. Oh, hello, I'm Lenora. Pardon me if I seem a little distracted at the moment. Everyone thinks I'm utterly balmy. Samantha thinks I'm potty. But it's this painting. I never noticed it before. If I know Hogwarts, and I do, an empty frame doesn't appear for no reason. There's something more to this. <laughs> Do you learn anything about it? Have you gained any insights about the painting since you've been studying it? I did discover that casting Lumos has an effect of some kind. But I'm not sure what to do next. Okay. Are there any other empty paintings like this around the school? Yes, a few. This entire place is somewhat of a riddle, to be honest. If I can work out the riddle of this one, I'll know what to do with all of them. As good a place as any to begin. Mm -hmm. That's fair. If I have the time, I may look. Could be intriguing. <sighs> I've been racking my brains long enough. I hope you'll have better luck than I have. Well, since I only have one spell. Do come and Lumos. Me if you stumble on that spot must be a clue. I should look around in case it's nearby. Okay. Like that. Rumor has it there's an abandoned manor near Bargain Type. No one knows what happened to the Downstairs. This looks like the location yeah. from the painting. What could be so... Sp Let's get you back to your frame, little moth. Oh. Okay. So you go to the place that's shown in the image, and you pick up a moth. Go back. And... Ha! Yeah. I knew there was a connection. I should tell Lenora that I solved the puzzle of that empty frame. Okay. Did 
challenges and field guide pages. Oh, claim rewards. And oh, 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 okay. So I can't claim, I, I can either claim the lower one or I can let them build up to a higher one. Those would have been nice. Okay. And appearance. Spectacles. Inventory. Gear. Thought I had them. could do for me. Compass goes this way though. Oh, you're Lenore. Lenora, I solved the mystery of that painting. You did? How? Followed the clues. Well, I found the location depicted in the painting, and then I cast Lumos to guide a moth back to the frame. All very logical, I suppose. A pity I was so close to solving it. You have a knack for solving riddles. Matty's good at that, too. So is Meat, although he does tend to over-explain. <laughs> well, I'm glad someone figured it out. The moth! I should have seen that! relationship quest. That's kind of cool. And I seem to have gained a level. Collections. Cobalt Regalia. An ensemble for those with poise and refinement earned by solving the mystery of the empty painting frame. Okay. Challenge quest. Completed one of three side relationship quests. Complete two main story quests.
Revelio. Seems like it pinged something. spell a lot. Some griffins. Well this is cool. I wish the windows were transparent. Defense against the Dark Arts Tower. Rebellion. You how nice to see you, my young friend. Oh, you spoke. You... Lumos. Kind of a greenish painting under a balcony? Which means downstairs? that? Just stuff everywhere. Rebellion. Two lock. Got an eyeball on it. No. Rebellion. Oh, hey. No. Rebellion. Look at that again. Two pillars and a window, kind of a rounded grating. Two pillars, a window, kind of a rounded grating. Pillars? Window?
that over there. Seeing the two pillars. That human's now a teacher as well. Rebellion. Lumos. things in the background all over the place. Okay, you lock yourself when I come around you. Free tea. Lumos. something. unlock. Okay, we need an unlocking spell. Downstairs. And you go here. That was it. 
Okay. direction was I supposed to go? Let's go the other way. Yep. Okay. So that's Charmed class. Or am I going? I'm going away from it. Okay. Look at the mini map. I'm going to get lost. A lot. <laughs> Downstairs. Upstairs. room and got another chest. Hmm. Handy just... resource indeed, your fields are Yep, gotta go to class. Up another floor. Professor Roman tends to go Don't on a bit. Some we sometimes okay. remind him to finish the lesson. So that's where some I need to go. Some of us don't necessarily want him to get back to the lesson. Oh, I wish I could spend all day in class. Oh. Okay, that's where we're heading next. But it's been over an hour, so... We're going to call that an episode, and next episode we're going to go to our first class, and we're going to hopefully be able to get the Akio spell. That's going to be interesting. So we'll get our first spell that's not just given to us. Uh, continue the plot line and see what else we can find. So thanks for watching. Uh, thanks for being here with me while I play through this blind playthrough. Um, please like, comment, subscribe, and share. See you next time.